Hey, what's going on, everybody? This is Tyrone back with Tech Life. And here we have a great article from the Mobile Report, which I will leave a link to it in the description down below so you guys could check it out. So, more bad news for T Mobile customers, and the timing couldn't be worse. Coming off of the second breach this year, we are now approaching the May 18th date, which is the final date that you have for you to change your auto pay information. Now, moving forward, starting May 18th, you will have to use a bank account or a debit card on your account to continue your auto pay discount. You can no longer use a credit card. So like I said, timing is just really, really bad on this. And this is going to be more bad news for T-Mobile customers that are going to want to continue this discount. If by chance the T-Mobile customer does not want to continue the discount and they don't want to add a debit or bank account because of the recent breaches and not feeling safe, you're just simply going to pay a higher bill. You're going to pay more. It's not going to be a lot more, but it's going to be depending on account. It could be 10, 15, 20 dollars, especially the more lines you have, the bigger, the bigger, the discount. And that's going to be added on to your bill. So this is kind of a lose lose situation for the customer. I would say if you add your bank account, of course, you're at risk of another hack potentially but you do get to maintain that discount if you don't add if you don't feel comfortable adding your uh, a bank a bank card or a, um, a checking account then you're subject to that increase on your bill so i will leave a link to this in the description down below there is a 30-day grace period so keep that in mind starting may 18th you will start getting notified via text probably email and then starting on that date, you have 30 more days to change all of that info moving forward. So let me know what you think about that in the comment section down below. Like I said, the timing is just really bad on this coming off of a second data breach for the year. Now, I, like I said, luckily only 836 customers were affected. But then the one earlier in the year, 37 million customers were affected. And now T-Mobile wants you to put your bank account info for auto pay. So make sure you guys stay tuned to the channel for more. Like, share, subscribe, follow my social media outlets. This is Tyrone with Tech Life. See y'all in the next one. Peace.